Yep guys, welcome to my channel. It's Rune Xblade and in today's video, I'll show you how to render unlimited big Minecraft map in Prisma 3D or Recon 4D. The trick is same by the way. So in today's video, I will get straight to WinLetter so I can export my map model. If you don't know how to export OBJ map from Minecraft or how to use WinLetter, then you should watch the this video. Link is in description. And if you face any problem there, then you can comment. I will make a separate video on that. So the trick is, so the trick is to render big maps is simple. You have to create small pieces of the map that you have, that your device can handle without any lag. This trick is specially for low devices. For example, this size of the map, my phone can handle easily. So this is our first piece. I will export four pieces and show you how to merge them while editing and you can add more pieces to expand your map let's name it map1 and while exporting note the map note the map coordinates and the position of the map i will export 100 by 100 blocks map and here's a pro tip for you take a screenshot of the big map in minus and after exporting model, I will take another same size map beside the previous part. For that, I will just change the same map's name and change the coordinates in settings. As I have noted the coordinates, I don't have to guess. I can select exact size and location of the map. And like this, we have to export map in small pieces. Depends on how big map you want to render. The bigger the map, the more pieces you will need. You can skip this part if you want. Now in Prisma 3D, import the first piece of the map, as I have named them, so I know which piece will go where, and I am using Prisma 3D legacy app because it's 2.1 version of Prisma 3D and also available in Play Store. So set up the map and add a plane and resize it as the same size of the map. Then rename it and save it to presets and save the project then open new project and add next map set up the map then add the preset and relocate the map according to the screenshot of the large map do the same with other map pieces also so here our four pieces are ready now let's render the first project add camera animate it add light then group the light and the camera, set the camera background color to black, rename it and save it to preset. Render the scene and you will also need a mask render. To create that, set light intensity to 0 and set lighting to night and render. Now open next project, add group of the light and the camera from presets, render the scene and also don't forget to render the mask do the same for other projects too after we get all the rendering done now let's go to post processing the best app according to me is Elite motion for this kind of editing you can edit it in other apps too but in Elite motion it's easy to explain the editing so here i am in Elite motion let's add the first clip this is the clip of the piece which is closer to the camera so all other pieces are behind it so I don't need to add mask for this. Let's add the second clip and as here you can see we have to hide this part of this map. So here we need the mask and you have to add all mask renders which is front of the piece. So if for example I will add one mask here, blend it as multiply. Then group the clip and the mask 
and then blend the group as screen. Now you can see that the other render is merged merge in the scene. Now let's add the third clip. And as this piece is behind all pieces so I have to add all other mask renders and blend them as multiply. Group them with the third clip and blend the group as screen. Same thing with the last piece also. Add the render, add mask of front pieces, blend to multiply, group them, blend the group to screen and done. I did everything in a same project because I wanted to explain the post processing and I recommend you to create mask clip in different projects because here if I play this you can see it's not playing smoothly. So yeah, that's all. I showed you a cool trick to render large area of Minecraft map in your load device. If you have any problem, you can comment. And if you like this video, you know what to do. We will meet again in the next video. Bye.